Coach, after a 2-1 comeback win on Sunday against Lake Erie, do you feel the team is playing their best soccer of the season? Uh, well, I think we're, we're playing, uh, we're, we're finding our form. Uh, I think it's been a gradual process throughout the course of the season. And uh, I think there's no better time than to be finding it than right now uh, with two weeks left, playing probably um, some of our best competition uh, we've seen all season. Even on the second time around, those teams are getting better. And we know what's at stake, and so do they. So uh, it's, it's good to be playing um, at a high level at this point of the season. Multi-sport star Brent Wally was named GLIAC Player of the Week in both football and now soccer twice. How much confidence has he gained by playing two sports? He's always had the confidence. Um, he's always been. Uh, he's a good. He's a good uh, college player. Uh, he knows what it takes to get himself ready and balance the day-to-day uh, -day rigor of both sports. Um, I think he's truly, uh, in the sense of the word professionalism, um, has shown that uh, throughout the course of the season, and I think that's what's kind of helped him get these awards as well. Our defense has played a big part in many games this season. Talk a little bit about them. Yeah, the back line, we've got, we're pretty deep in the back line. I mean, we've had a couple of knickknacks here and there. Uh, guys have had to take some time off a couple of days and maybe part of games. And uh, we've been able to fill them in with uh, uh, young guys that, that are getting experience and, and really holding their own. Uh, it's been surprising to see the young guys in the back line do well. But the guys returning, the back four starters, we can we can interchange any of our seven or eight back line guys uh, any given game, and it seems like we're on the same page, which is a great quality to have. We have Malone on Friday. Talk a little bit about what to expect from the Pioneers. They're in need of three points. They're going to come here and they're going to give everything they have. They know they need to win the next few games in order to secure themselves a, a playoff spot. At the same time, we're trying to. Uh, stay in the playoff hunt and, and hopefully secure uh, a, a conference regular season championship and to do that we've got to be at our sharpest here in the next uh, this Friday. The last time we played Tiffin we beat them 3-2 at our place in a very physical game. What is the mindset this time around heading up there? A challenge. It's going to be a great challenge. Uh, both teams are fighting for right now for the conference championship. Uh, we know Tiffin's a quality team. They've got quality players. They know the same in us, and uh, it's, uh, it's going to be a battle for sure for uh, the championship. All right, Coach, thanks and good luck. Appreciate it.